I mean, the third period of overtime. Um, no, I don't think it was a whole lot. I think uh, just keep playing. I thought in the second and third we played pretty well, so um, just keep playing and, and wearing on them. And uh, obviously, Woody, what a play and what a move. Okay, it looked like Manson knocked it out of the air. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We have to see it. Yeah, that's great. I'll, I'll track that and thank him. <laughs> I'm sure he was asking you about that, but the saves in overtime, right? Two on Sagan, one on Johnston. Just what, take me through that sequence. Uh, yeah, that, the one we talked about on Sagan, uh, the guy came wrapped around and made a quick backdoor pass, and I uh, just uh, tried to make a stretch there and get, get my leg and uh, tried to pick it up and managed, managed to get my glove on it. And the other one, which one was that? Uh, I don't know. There were two on Sagan, one on Johnston, but that's okay. Yeah. <laughs> when, when you're down three nothing, but you got the team in front of you that you have, like you still feel we're in, we're in this game, we're in any game. Yeah, we we had some experience winning, uh, winning big comebacks, and you try to try to play full sixty, um, try not to uh, not to think about the past and keep keep to the game plan, uh, play full sixty, see what happens, and uh, the guys the guys scored big goals at the right times, and uh, overall. Found a way to win. That's that's huge for us. Coach had said that you guys were antsy, obviously, for having so much time off. And that first period, did it take you a, a little bit of time to kind of get in your rhythm because coming out a little anxious, or did you feel like you were in your groove as soon as you got on the ice? No, I felt I felt pretty okay there. Uh, can't say much. How did you guys land on Billy Jean as a locker room win song? Uh -huh. I, I don't know. <laughs> uh, maybe maybe sometime we we got a big win and stuck with it. I'm not really sure. Do you enjoy hearing it on the road here for game one? Uh, yeah, yeah, absolutely. Thanks. Thanks, Thanks Jordy. Yeah. It wasn't a three nothing game. Uh, we had a lot of good shifts. Uh, I thought, and uh, yeah, we stayed positive. Really upbeat after the first. You know, no negativity, and uh, you know, we didn't know we could, if we could come back or not. We just wanted to see and give ourselves a, a chance, and we did. And uh, it feels great. The power play was so valuable in this going perfect tonight. Just talk to me about that five man unit and what it's been able to do so far in this playoffs. Yeah, it's been huge. I mean, it's our job to produce in the power play. Um, it's so tight out there. You guys are. Um, you know, playing so hard defensively, the power play is huge, and I'm sure they're making some adjustments. But you know, we got to keep finding ways to produce. Facing the Stars team, were the things that you were expecting, things that were you know they, they did well tonight that made it more challenging for you? What were you kind of noticing out there from them? Everything we expected. Uh, you know, a low event game, tight game. Um, you know, it was uh, definitely tough taking a week off. Uh, you know, it took us a bit, but once we found our legs, I thought we had a great second, great third, and uh, they were buzzing the OT. Georgie made some huge saves, and uh, Woody had a great goal. Nate, what just what was the? I mean, in case you're just saying not much being, need, needs to be said between the third period and overtime. Just what was the, the mood in the room? Good, yeah, good. I mean, uh, definitely stayed positive the whole game. I think would have been easy to kind of fold after that first period, but um, you know, we felt like we were playing better than what, than what the score showed, and. We wanted to see it through, and uh, definitely happy to get the comeback. On that, you know, you said it would have been easy to kind of crumble. Just, what, I know we ask you all the time, but what more can you say about the character in this room? Yeah, it's huge. I just think staying even keel is uh, the biggest thing. Um, you know, guys are upbeat, positive after the first. Um, you know, we didn't know if we could come back or not, but we wanted to at least try. And uh, you know, we never know what could happen in playoff hockey. Sometimes it's, it's hard to hold leads. You know, we've been there too. Um, but uh, got to move on. Get ready for game two now. Sorry if this was asked, but in between the first and second, did you lean on the comeback efforts in the regular season against Dallas as motivation, proof of concept that you could overcome a three-goal deficit? Yeah, for sure. I think, um, you know, against Dallas and then all, all playoffs, you know, we've been pretty good from uh, down a few. And um, tonight was no different. Like I said, it, it didn't feel like they were dominating us. Uh, you know, they had a seeing eye shot. Um, you know, one went off our defenseman's stick, and then I forget the other one. But you know, definitely felt like uh, we were in it, uh, even though it was three, three nothing. Nate, it was announced this morning that you're one of three finals for the Hart Trophy. What would it mean to you to win that award? I'm not even thinking about that. Uh, you know, I'm so invested in this playoff run. Um, obviously, appreciate everyone voting for me. Um, but yeah, definitely just trying to trying to win here with the the boys. Were there any similarities in the regular season comebacks to this one, or is this different? Uh, yeah, I don't know. Um, 
I, honestly, I, I don't know. It's such a grind out there. Uh, it's uh, it takes a lot out of you. Out of you, obviously, is our first overtime in this playoffs, and um, definitely thought we could have played a little better in OT, but happy to get the win. It's been a lot of talk about rest as a weapon over the last week. Do you feel like that rest kind of came in handy over the second and third period as the game moved on? It could have, yeah. I mean, I I definitely uh, feel better when I'm in a rhythm. Um, I don't love taking time off, uh, but. You know, I think we'll feel better as we play two, three, four here. Um, you know, it's tough. You know, they, they were just in it on Sunday. Obviously, they're they might have been a little more tired, but they still have the the timing. Um, you know, their their rhythm for sure. They had a great series against Vegas, so um, hopefully we we can play even better next time. Last one for Nate, guys. Thanks so much.